My name is Rami Zureik, I'm, I'm a professor at the Faculty of uh, Agriculture and Food Sciences in the Landscape and uh, Ecosystem Management uh, Department and also the current director of the Interfaculty Graduate Environmental Sciences Program and uh, both the Faculty of Agriculture and the, the Environmental Sciences Program have the pleasure of hosting uh, this uh, Symposium, which is a big word for uh, a rather small do, which brings together uh, people who have been working uh, alongside of each other for uh, a couple of years, and you will get to meet them today on issues that are related to environment, agriculture, and labor in the Arab world. I'm, uh, I'm also extending this uh, uh, welcome on behalf of Dean Nahalakwala, the Dean of the Faculty of Agriculture, who uh, not uh, make it, but has asked me to uh, greet you on her behalf. I will uh, give the floor to Marta, who will provide adequate uh, uh, introduction. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ali, go sit somewhere else. <laughs> uh, it is a great pleasure to be here, and uh, this is uh, an event that is organized by our attempt to create a research collective under the name of CIMAR. And we have a website that it is, is under construction, which is www.athimar.org, uh, on which we have been posting the kinds of work we are attempting to do and, the la and reports on the last two workshops as well as a number of papers and we hope to develop that uh, since we have funding for the next three years to develop that website. But today I'm very grateful to the, uh, the American University of Beirut and to the Faculty of Agriculture and Food Sciences and the Inter-Faculty Graduate Environmental Sciences Program for hosting uh, uh, this meeting here in, uh, in collaboration between PIMAR and WB. And I'll chair the first session. And so I'll first, let me give you a word or two about the aims of DIMAR in slightly greater detail. We aim to share information and analysis, to promote basic research, and to open policy debate on the nexus linking agriculture, environment, and labor. As we know, the quality of economic and social data produced in the region is often poor, and university-based research, and in fact, all of those who are going to speak today are presently in in, in universities or were in universities, uh, is uh, privileges political analysis over basic socioeconomic <coughs> documentation. And so Imo seeks to work with others to counter such lacunae. And it's not just a matter of knowledge in the abstract. As we've seen throughout the protests of 2011, working and unemployed people in and from the countryside have expressed their distress. And perhaps nowhere is this as clear as in Syria, let alone Yemen. But by transmitting their voices also, Thimar will in turn seek to respond to what is a brutal restructuring of agrarian relations and related environmental plunder. As researchers and to some extent activists, we bring together perspectives from agronomy, anthropology, economics, geography, public health, and sociology. And so following our two workshops, we're working on the development of the website, on the development of other research pro projects, and on the development of, e of electronic publishing. So that's just for the fourth email. I want to invite the two speakers who are going to address us this morning, and I will give you a brief introduction to all of those who are uh, speaking today. If Rami uh, Zure and Ali Khadri could uh, uh, um, come out, that would be great, uh, just to sit, uh, sit with me. Uh, today you're going to hear from Habib Ayyad, who is uh, one of our uh, founding members, who is a geographer, a Tunisian in origin, who's going to show his film here this afternoon, and if you can't make it, there will be another, I mean, he's made several films, but the most recent one, uh, 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 he's going to show it also tomorrow evening at uh, Temar Bota. Uh, at 7 o'clock, uh, and it concerns the crisis of agriculture in Tunisia. He's also written a brilliant book on uh, the, the crisis of agriculture in uh, 
uh, and what is and the transformation of agrarian relations in Egypt, which is entitled La Crise de la Société Rurale en Egypte, La Fin du Fela, uh, in 2010. We hope it will be <coughs> translated into English. Uh, we have also with us Professor Ray Bush, who is uh, a professor of African Studies and Development Politics at the University of Leeds, and he will speak in the afternoon to Egypt. He has long running work also on agriculture in Egypt. This morning we have uh, Dr. Ali Padri, who is presently a senior fellow at the Middle East Institute in the National in, uh, University of Singapore, and who is going to speak to the region of the uh, economy more widely. And Ravi Zarek, who is probably the best known to, the, to our audience, who is here at the Faculty of Agriculture, and who is going to uh, attempt to cast critical uh, eye on his own work in presuppositions in, and try to break out in his presentation this morning. And finally, I'm the, the, and the senior anthropologist in the picture, uh, and my name is Martha Mundy, and I taught at AUB in the, the early 90s, as well as many years in Jordan in the 80s, and I worked in Yemen uh, and in Jordan, but I am um, presently getting back from historical work into this kind of uh, work on, on the present agrarian crisis in the region, and particularly on Yemen. I'll speak a bit to Yemen because Yemen is often sort of invisible or off, off, the, off the screen, and it, it's a uh, crisis of the rural sector is one of the most acute. Okay. So let me hand over and not waste any more time. Uh, the, our first speaker will be the, uh, Dr. Ali Padre. Do you want to go I mean, where are you where are you feel comfortable speaking? What do you want to do? Well, uh, maybe because I have to flip this. Uh, I don't know. Uh, 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 thank you. Uh, I, I will speak for about 25 minutes. Well, no, no, I mean, that's and by the way, I, I'll take, I think we'll take questions for both at the end, uh, uh, even though they're going to be very useful kinds of papers, but I think that way we can open up discussion since I see we have a, a rather interested audience as opposed to somehow uh, those who are not deeply concerned by this, these sets of problems. And we are trying in Timor to get these disciplines that say they are going to be interdisciplinary and don't usually talk to each other to talk to each other. So we'll fund we'll up the discussion in, after the two papers. <coughs> 